age they say is just a number it depends on who is saying it and life they say begins at the age of 40. If you are new to my channel, my name is Dr. Balfour. Thank you so much for joining me today. Five things to do to keep yourself in shape and healthy and be happy and live a very good life at the age of 40 and above. So let's dive into it. I just say it begins at the age of 40 and a lot of people keep saying, oh, uh, everything will begin at the age of 40 and that um, some also say age is a just a number and it depends on who is saying it because you can be 45 and you still look like someone who is 30 and you can be 30 and you look like someone who is in, in the late 40s it depends on how well you keep yourself on check uh, it depends on how well you take care of yourself and a lot of people do not take care of themselves yet they think age uh, just, is just a number no if you're not taking care of yourself age will not be a num just a number to you you get sick all the time you get admitted all the time in the hospital now number one on the list is avoiding stress stress is one of the component or one of the uh, hormones that it release uh, to suppress your body and to suppress some of your cells and your organs uh, leading to you getting unwell leading to you uh, aging early instead of uh, keeping yourself healthy to live longer i'm going to tell you why it, it happens that way when you're stressed you release a hormone called cortisol cortisol can be a good cortisol or a bad cortisol the bad cortisol is when it activates certain enzymes and chemicals and metabolism in the body. It, it, it increases your blood sugar leading to diabetes. It can also cause high cholesterol. It's a long term. It doesn't take a day for, for these things to happen. It takes gradual process for the body to uh, get to that level. So when you are stressed all the time, you're always causing your body to produce excess amount of certain um, chemicals or enzymes that uh, fortify you to live a shorter life meaning you get on well easily even though you are 40 or you're 50 instead of you to live a help a healthy life you're always being admitted in the hospital it's because of the stress level that you've allowed yourself to accommodate to let go certain things you need to be happy you need to build yourself to uh, live a happy life and that brings me to number two of my my point number two is exercising exercising it plays a very vital role in developing yourself and keeping yourself healthy one of the things that you can do is to go to the gym other things you can do yoga or you can stretch every morning when you wake up and also get a quiet time to allow the body to adjust to the new way of the day there are so many studies that have proven that when you exercise you keep your blood pressure low you minimize your chances of getting diabetes you uh, reduces your chance of getting high cholesterol being obese these are the things that you can avoid when you exercise and many people do not really understand the importance of exercising if you want to live a happy life if you want to keep saying age is just a number then you have to exercise you have to stretch you have to do yoga you have to have a quiet time and enjoy the environment the exercise is it's a pivotal uh, tool uh, which will help you live a healthy life number three is doing what you like doing best or doing what you like doing the most if you are not enjoying your work stop quit and look for another job that will make you feel happy in yourself because at the end of the day you go to number one being stressful if you're not happy in your job why do you keep working in that specific job is it because you are earning a monthly salary or what what what, what is keeping you there because it suppresses your your life it makes you look so unwell because you're always complaining of the job that you're doing so stop it now and look for another job or you can do your own work to build your own finances so do what you can do best do what you think will make you feel more happier than something that will not make you happy but working will make you happy don't work then 
but you have to also make sure that if you're not working you're not earning anything so you still go back to poverty and, and so yeah it's, it's it's something you want to sit down and brainstorm and find ways of keeping yourself happy life is short you don't want to keep yourself unhappy all the time being stressful and getting unwell and getting anxiety and all these factors that can uh, initiate uh, you're born into a situation where you cannot come out. If you're 40 and you've achieved so many things and you're living a life, you're happy with your life, you're exercising, you're doing so many things to keep yourself in, in, in shape and to keep yourself financially free, leave your message, let's share your experiences, let's know what you're doing and what is helping and let's also learn from it. Thank you. So number four on the list is finances, building your finances. Building your family is very integral part of uh, having a wonderful and a successful life, being it health or fun, uh, being it uh, money-wise. Because many people do not have 100 pounds or 100 dollars in their savings. They always depend on how uh, and what they earn at the end of the month. So when the money comes into the bank, then it, it just vanish again. You are unable to save, you are not able to keep money in the bank, you are not able to uh, pay certain things, you are always owing. Instead of you saving, you are not able to save because you are paying debts all the time. Now uh, it's time for you to think. At the age of 40, there are so many things that you have to be doing. You don't have the whole decades to yourself. Anything can happen at any time. So save, get pension, personal pension, if you want to invest in stock, buy good stocks. These are the three factors that you want to really consider doing to keep yourself moving and to live a very wonderful, happy life uh, being 14 and above. My last point is enjoy life and buy what you, what you feel like buying. That is if you have enough money. Make sure you are not using money that does not belong to you. Use money you've saved. Enjoy. Don't be too frugal. Your life is not long for you to be saying, okay, uh, you don't want to even spend 10 pounds or 20 pounds going out to enjoy a wonderful dinner or a coffee or anything of that sort. So spend while you can and enjoy your life. It's short. You want to enjoy your life. You, need to, you want to be healthy, you want to eat good healthy food, so you need to spend buying good food, going to uh, uh, places that will make you feel happy. These are the things you want to consider at the age of 40 and above. Thank you so much for watching my video. Once again, take care for now.